Hey Brittany. So what we're going to be talking about today is attraction marking. And what that is, is pretty self-explanatory. We're going to be talking about be attracting people to you. That's what we want. So um, what we're going to talk about first is I have my little board I wrote so I could keep everything together. <laughs> but we're going to be talking about keeping your Facebook page positive. Do not post anything controversial. If it's about abortion, presidential, nothing. We don't want negative because that brings negative people to your Facebook. So we want to keep it positive. Inspirational quotes. People love that. They eat it up. Um, yeah, so anything like interactive, you like those interactive posts, people love those. So just keep doing those, but just make sure you keep it positive. Like if you're upset about something, do not post it on your Facebook. Your Facebook page is your business page. That it, this is how, this is what you're doing to make a living. So do not do that. Okay. Because I, I, I don't want this to keep you from preventing making money. So, okay. Next thing we're going to be talking about, which you ladies need to start working on, and I'm going to help you along the way, is recruiting. We want more ladies, okay? Recruiting. How do you get recruits? Do you know? You have to ask. Yes, I know it's so shocking, but you have to ask, ladies, have you heard about this opportunity? Tell ladies what you nix about. Write them, message them. Um, but one thing you need to know, say less is more. Keep it simple. Tell them, well, all you have to do is buy the $99 starter kit, have no additional fees, for the rest of your life. Um, yeah, I mean, that's all you have to do. And ask them, do you have any more questions for me? If they have questions, you answer them. That's it. And if they keep, you keep answering them, and then when you ask them, do you have any more questions for me? And they say no, they're like, okay, I think you're ready to join. You welcome them before they even join, because that makes them. I mean, that closes the deal, like, you, um, just don't write a novel when you're talking to them about it. It overwhelms them. Like, you don't want to, like, people don't like, I mean, I'm, especially y'all, I mean, when someone writes you a novel about something, you don't want to read all that, you know? So, another thing, if you're writing, messaging people, I know we're adding, you're supposed to be adding like 10 to 15 people a day. Supposed to be messaging about 20 to 30 people a day. So it's okay if they ignore you. Because you know what you're doing? You're planting a seed. Because they're asking themselves, well, what are they doing? Are they really making money? Is it a scam? They're thinking of questions in their head and they're going to come back and ask you. Because once they see that you're making money and you're being successful in this business, they're going to come back. And also, use, and if they come up with an excuse on why they can't join, these are three things you can use. Feel, felt, found. Feel, felt, found. They'll, if they're like, oh, well, I'm a mom and I don't have time, you're like, oh, I know exactly how you feel. I have a 16-month-old at home. But, um, I found that I can work from home and take care of my child. There's one example. Here's another one. Um, well, I really just don't have the time because I have to take my kids to soccer practice and I have a full-time job. I know exactly how you feel. I found that since I have, I have a full-time job, have a 16-month-old. And take my child to daycare or wherever. Um, like those types, like you just, you relate to them. You start conversation with them. You get to know them. And also, 
you need to, like when y'all get a sale, you want to follow up with your customers. Because your customers, if they keep buying and buying and buying from y'all, they are going to, they are more prone to becoming a unique presenter than anybody. So, you know, and like say someone bought some foundation from you and you're going to be like, you're going to follow up with them a week later. They're going to be like, and you're going to ask them, oh, well, did you like the foundation you got? I mean, is it the right color and everything? Are you satisfied with it? They're going to be like, oh, yes, I love it. There it is. Your next question. Hey, girl, have you ever thought about um, becoming a unique presenter? You wait and see what they say. And you're also, I have another thing. You're going to use the three C's. Crazy, compliment, confident. This is something you're going to message girls. You're going to say, call me crazy, but um, you just take the most greatest selfies. You're just so beautiful. You're so confident. And I was just wondering if you'd ever thought about joining Unique. And those are the three C's. You're going to, you're going to be... Oh, this that may sound crazy, and you're going to compliment them on something, like saying how successful they are, saying how genuine they are, how beautiful they are, how um, funny they are, anything that you, you know, anything like that. And you're also, ladies, I know I'm kind of bouncing everywhere, but this is like, these are the how you're going to be successful in this business. You're also going to, I mean... You want people to know you, and you want people to, you want to be popular on Facebook. So what you're going to do is you're going to, you're going to comment on everybody's stuff. Like, I mean, if they have a picture, a selfie, and they have some awesome lipstick, you're going to compliment it. Girl, you, you're looking fab today. Mmm. You are, your makeup's on point. You are looking awesome. Okay, if they have kids, comment how beautiful their children are. If they have dogs, comment how pretty their dogs are. I mean, anything like that. And you're also going to want to ask questions on your Facebook Live. People love parenting questions. I don't know if y'all have ever seen that. But ask a question like, oh, um, say something like, ask about, you know, where, where's the best uh, place for my children to go play? Where is... Uh, Where's the best food place in town? You know, people like giving advice. People like helping other people. More, I mean, normal people do. I mean, so do those kind of things like that. Do not throw up unique all over your Facebook page. People don't want that. People care about themselves. And if you post, if you just throw up unique all over your Facebook, they're just going to be like, oh, well, all they want is my money. That's exactly what they think. Like, I had a girl write me the other day, and they, she said that, um, I wrote her, and I was just asking her if she, you know, wanted to, we had a sale going on, and I was just asking if she wanted to order anything, and she was, she cussed me out, saying all I was doing was trying to sell her stuff, which is not the case, and I just told her how sorry I was, and that, um, I hope she had a blessed day, and that's all you can do, but you, I mean, you're going to have haters, and Kayla has a video on her believe page that y'all need to watch about haters because you're gonna have them and don't get discouraged because those people are just negative and we, we don't need that we need a positive outlook on y'all's facebook pages okay um just and like just recruiting i mean it is hard and um you can do the pre-launch parties like y'all both did did fabulous and it is, you know, it's hard, the pre-launch parties. Like, I would, I would much rather people just outright buy the stuff. But, you know, a lot of people don't have the money, which is okay. But you can also, like, if, and like using the um, feel felt found, if they were like, oh, well, I can't afford it. Well, you can be like, well, I know a girl that went in her closet and got seven pairs of shoes, sold them on the online yard sale sites. And she made her $100 on selling stuff that she didn't even use. If they really want it, they will do it. Okay? Um, if y'all have any questions, just message me. I just, 
feel like we need to start doing this every Monday because I feel like it's helping me and it's helping y'all. So, um, if y'all have any questions, y'all just let me know, okay? Love y'all. Bye.